It's hard to believe, but the drought is still impacting more than half of the state, and Coleman County is facing some dire conditions. People living there are banned from washing their cars and watering their lawns. CBS 42 News reporter Britt Moore live in Coleman County with why leaders there are preparing for the worst. Britt, good morning. Our good morning. Yeah, back during uh, the drought in 2007, Lake Katoma was down about 26 feet. Today, the lake is down about 22, almost 23 feet. So not a good sign of the direction we're heading in. Now, the city of Coleman recently passed a measure asking customers to reduce their water usage, and this county followed suit. Now, Lake Katoma is the only source of drinking water for the county, supplying tens of thousands of customers. And right now, now, the lake is extremely low and some parts of the lake are completely dry. Don't need to be watering lawns, don't need to be washing vehicles. Like I say, don't be leaving the water on while you're brushing your teeth. Uh, it's it's uh, very crucial that we save every drop that we can. Now, the city does have a new dam. It's called Duck River, but can't use that water for another three years because of the Department of Environmental Management's rules. So the county is really doing all it can to make sure it can make it until those three years are up. Now, we, of course, will have a list of all of the water restrictions uh, online, WIAT.com. They'll be posted in this story. Uh, definitely still an ongoing drought situation here. For now, we're live in Coleman County this morning. Britt Moore, CBS. Yes, 42 News.